What's going on? Dan here. And in case you're wondering what that first video clip was, um, that was actually a thunderstorm that we had exactly a week ago from today. I believe so, yeah. So, in case you're wondering, like that, like some of it was pretty awesome, but like all the like all the powerful storms there that they were predicting that we we're gonna have, um, didn't exactly hit our area, so. We kind of forecasted that wrong, but hey, a thunderstorm is a thunderstorm, nevertheless. And then a couple days later, um, not j not this last Monday, but the Monday before, um, we had a little snowstorm up here in Minnesota. Yep, that's what people up here call it when it snows, Minnesota. I like that because it just fits in. It just really fits in well. And unfortunately for Wisconsin, we don't have any clever name for that, but oh well. Okay, so now on to some of the things I did this week. Basically, again, nothing too out of the ordinary, just just all my classes and stuff. But um, last night, I did go to um, our women's hockey game, and unfortunately, um, we lost against the school we were playing. And our final score was, the final score was four to one, us losing again. But it was exciting to go to, I guess. And I did say something that I guess that had, to, that I guess would have to make up for that loss, uh, would be something exciting for me that happened during the game. Our mascot sitting next to me, that was pretty darn awesome. Like he was like being all funny and stuff, and he, he shook up uh, my Mountain Dew and. Or thinking that I would open it just right after that, but unfortunately that trick does not work if you only have a half-filled soda bottle. So nice try there, but yeah, it was still funny that he did that. So I guess that I guess just that exciting moment made up for the loss of that game. But on a happy note, um, today or earlier today at noon. Um, we had our first game of the NCAA Division Three Championship, and we won that first game, so we are advancing into the playoffs now. And this is very, very awesome, because we had an undefeated season. 10-0, and baby! So, just to keep this winning streak going, it's just freaking awesome. So, as I said, that game was pretty awesome. I actually didn't stay for a whole game though. I left at halftime because I wanted to get a workout in, and I just did it in our athletic center, which is right by our stadium and football field, so I could still watch them in the game at least while getting my workout in. So there you go. And in terms of other plans, um, later tonight at ten, I'm gonna be going to do something or some. Cosmic Bowling. It's in the basement of our student center. We have a little bowling alley there, and basically what Cosmic Bowling is, is they have, like, all the lights in the place off, and they have, like, they have, like, a little lights on each of the lanes. And I believe they also have black lights, too, so that should be pretty cool. Holy crap, what was that? I wonder if that's going to appear in video. <laughs> That'll be interesting to see. So... To get myself hyped up for that, I'm having a good old Red Bull. Which gives you wings. Not a sponsor. But, uh, actually, in reality, it doesn't. But, hey, that'd be cool, wouldn't it? And again, about that dot I just saw bounce across my screen. I wonder if that's going to appear in video. We will just have to see. And then, tomorrow... It's basically going to be a chill day. I'm going to be getting like whatever homework I have done. Well, I basically... I did some earlier today, too. But I just, but it's going to be finishing off any remaining homework I have tomorrow. As well as watching the Packers game. They play the Detroit Lions. So, hopefully that should be a good game. And I should be able to get some, some of my um, fellow Packer fans... I'm here to watch it with me, or I can just go somewhere else and watch it, but no matter what, it'll still be fun to watch. 
And then, something else that I'm really excited for in the coming days, um, this coming Tuesday specifically, is that I get to go home a day early because my class... Because both my classes on Wednesday got canceled. Woohoo! Because our Thanksgiving break starts um, this Thursday, and it's Thursday, Friday, Thursday, Friday, and then obviously Saturday, Sunday, and then we get back the Monday after. So, you know what? I'll take an extra day in the weekend, or in the break. So I'm essentially going to have a five day weekend now. How awesome is that? I. Seriously, I'll, I'll take a five-day weekend whenever it's given to me. I really need this break because I've been working so darn hard this semester, and I I just really can't wait for it to be over and just get through finals and all and the hard times I'll have to deal with it with during them. So then it can be Christmas, woo, which is still a little over a month away. Oh, excuse me. It's a little hard to believe if I'd say so myself. So, there you have it. That's basically all I have going on right now. Oh, and as you can see, again, once again, sporting my wild swag. I'm just really hoping that the NHL can um, work the deal out. But, again, from the way things are look looking right now, it just doesn't look like anything's going to happen. So, I'm just... I'm just Try to keep my hopes up, but I probably shouldn't keep them up too much because they just ha keep having all these talks. And um, Batman and um, Daly, um, the, co the commissioner for or the commissioners for um, both the NHL and then the NHL PA, have just been saying like they like whenever they have like these little um, press conferences, like they it's just seven can't. Thank you, Mr. McIntosh. Um, they just can't. Um, discussed like any deals of like a proposal, which kind of annoys me because I really just want to know how how this agreement is coming between the players and the owners. Because when they made that fifty fifty agreement a couple weeks back, I think yeah, um, I thought they were actually going to accept that, and they didn't, and that pissed me off. Seriously, if they said that's the best thing or the best deal that they can make for them. But they didn't accept it. What are you thinking, players? Well, I guess that we all have to face the fact that these players are just freaking greedy millionaires. And they just want the money. So, there's nothing that us fans can do. So, there you go. Alright, that's about all I have to say for now. I'm going to leave you guys and... Actually, before I leave, I'm going to give you guys a question for the video. Uh, my question to you guys is, um, what movie have you seen recently, and did you like it? So, post your answer to, to that in the comments below, and I'll see you guys next time.